Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Faith and this is Faith's Pulse. I'm a Nigerian living in Brisbane, Australia. And on my channel, I talk about meaningful living, travel, and general living tips here in Australia. It's the 10th of August, a public holiday, so it's another opportunity to go out there and find out the fun place in Brisbane where I can show you guys. It's in Shoncliff and I'm definitely bringing you guys along. I haven't been there before. I know it's like a beach side and it's quite popular in Brisbane as well. But yeah, we're looking forward to finding a fun place where you and your friends and family you can also go and have a good time then definitely keep on watching when I go with confidence when I go the way around my hips and take my sip on it take a trip on it Hey guys, so we're finally in Shoncliffe. There's nothing serious happening here, but the side attraction in this area is just this bridge that goes all the way down there. I'm definitely gonna take the walk down there and bring you guys along. But yeah, this is what it looks like. And then there's a body of water all the way down to that side. It's quite chilly, it's quite cold. I have a jacket with me so no worries and I'm holding my hat tight so that it doesn't go into the water like the last time but yeah this is what it looks like guys I'm going to do the walk on the bridge now and I'll bring you guys with me Hey guys, so while walking on the bridge, we found this fish identification station. And as you can see, it has different fishes on the board. So you can identify your fishes. There's the white sand, the flathead, the crab, the snapper, the shark, the ray, and others. And on this side, there's a tabletop where I think you can wash your fish and, you know, just clean it up. This is quite untidy. I don't know why, but I think that it's thoughtful that this is here. There's also a tab for convenience. I just kind of wonder where this still what i runs into but i believe it's well thought out guys um if you're keen about fishing you definitely want to come here and enjoy yourself today there were lots of people out here fishing and it was just nice watching them and i was really hoping someone will catch a fish so i can see life goes up and it goes down i know my mom taught me that i figured why we fool around look guys i've never gone fishing before but fishing is definitely a thing for some people it was such a windy day and there were people out here with shorts waiting patiently in the cold just to see if they could catch a fish if you know anyone who's very keen about fishing or if you love to fish definitely come to sean cliff it's the spot so little and we keep track of time being so serious idiots thinking it will matter keep me 
oh and i also like that there's this shaded area here i believe it's just a resting place there are tables and chairs so i'm guessing you can just have a meal here as well there's also a sign reminding people not to wash or clean their fishes on these tables so basically the other tables i showed to you is the one where you can wash your fish and this is just a resting area for people to chill after they've had a good time fishing or if they just want to eat with family yay so finally someone caught something and i was excited to watch so this guy caught a stingray and it felt like everyone else was excited for him everyone gathered around him and started to watch him as he fiddled with the hooks but for some reason he took this and you know after some time he just lets it into the water and it just left me wondering why did he trade away do people eat stingrays is there a reason why you can't eat it but yeah guys that was what happened we saw him catch the stingray and throw it back into the water and you know was trying to wait for some more Mother got me the night ends. what you gonna do Honestly, I was hoping to stay out some more to see if anyone will catch something, but it was getting so cold I had to leave. But first, I took some really nice pictures and then we headed back. If you're keen, guys, there's a walk path called the Lover's Walk, which is about 2.5 kilometer. It's a great spot for jogging, walking your dog, or just walking to take in the view of the ocean and mountain. It's just on the other side of the beach. You can't miss it. So the highlight today was definitely watching this guy who caught the stingray that was quite exciting for me to observe we spent the rest of the day trying to get food and then we ended the day with watching a movie no way you about you. like your luck like your luck it's never ever gonna dry up no tell you what tell you what let's forget about it you got it all figured out in a way about you like you can't get enough can't get enough of wild nights So that's all for today's video we ended up seeing top gun at the movies ticket was 17 dollars i believe don't forget to leave me a comment like subscribe share and of course click on the notification bell so that you're notified whenever i upload a new video and i'll see you in my next one bye